This is the human papillomavirus. This virus, HPV for short, is very common and unfortunately almost always shows no symptoms, quietly living in human cells where it multiplies and causes growths that can lead to cancers later in life, such as throat cancer and cervical cancer. HPV infects people of all ages, including children. A mother can pass HPV to her child before or during birth. HPV can lead to growths in the throat, making it difficult for the child to breathe. So how do we prevent this? Get vaccinated. The advent of social media has brought a lot of misinformation regarding vaccines. Vaccines are safe and spend years in development and testing. The vaccine for HPV has been monitored for over 12 years to maintain its safety and effectiveness. It is developed, backed, and distributed by the World Health Organization and has proven to be extremely effective, providing safe and long-lasting protection against cancers that are caused by the HPV virus for boys and girls all over the world. It is important to note that vaccination treats new HPV but does not cure existing, so it's important to get vaccinated before any early exposure. Most vaccines are designed to be given before infections happen. Doctors recommend that children get the vaccination by the age of 11 or 12, but can start as early as 9. Young adults under the age of 26 are also encouraged to get the HPV vaccination. HPV vaccination is not recommended for everyone older than 26. However, some adults, ages 27 to 45, who were not already vaccinated may decide to get the HPV vaccine after speaking with their doctor about their risk for new HPV infections and the possible benefits of vaccination. The HPV vaccine requires two doses, the second dose coming 6 to 12 months after the first dose. The vaccine for HPV is long-lasting, so you may not need a booster down the road. Once you've been vaccinated, always talk to your care team about updates on the vaccine or any other questions you may have. The vaccination for HPV is safe and proven to be effective in preventing cancer. Vaccinate now to be safe later.